Hey, it's Brandy Lappins, and I'm here at Schubert's Ice Cream and Candy with Casey Reynolds. Um, just, she's going to be running for city council. The election is coming up on November 6th, so I just wanted to come down and chat with her a little bit, find out a little bit about Casey. You are fourth generation owner of Schubert's and downtown business Chico owner. Yeah. Tell us a little bit about that. How long? How did this progress through your family? So my great uncle started Schubert's in 1938, Whoa. and when he left Montana and was tired of being in the cold, he decided to open an ice cream store and come out to California sunshine. <laughs> so then my grandma and grandpa ran it, my mom and dad, and now my brother and I are at the helm as the fourth generation owners. Nice, so, and potentially fifth generation potential, with kids. Yeah, we never know. We'll see what they decide to do. Hopefully they'll take over so I have a retirement plan. So running a business in downtown Chico, uh, or as you mentioned before, in California in general. Can yeah. be a little tough. Tell us some of the challenges that you're facing. You know, there's several different challenges that we face. There's um, challenges that come at you from the state level, the county level, the city level. Um, I think right now one of the biggest challenges that we're facing is just a lot of the um, extracurricular activities that are happening in and around downtown and all over Chico. Um, we have some service resistant people that are um, making it difficult, harassing customers, leaving messes, making it, so you have to start doing extra cleanup before you open every day. Um, just making it a little bit harder to run your business and not as fun to come to the front door in the morning. Oh, gotcha. Well, that's too bad. Um, yeah, both of us born and raised here in Chico, and we definitely yeah. want to see it brought back to the Chico that you and I know. Tell us a little bit about what your priorities are if you are elected. So my priority is if I'm elected, I just, being born and raised here and having this great Chico way of life yeah. that we have all known to grow up and love in Chico, mm -hmm. I feel like that is being deteriorated a little bit. And I think there's a very small, minute amount of people that have really loud voices that are intent on destroying the fabric of this great community. So I just want to go fight for common sense. Um, reform that's going to work for the majority of Chico and that's going to attack some of those things so we can keep Chico the great place that it is to live yeah. and, and help, grow up help in. And business owners yes. thrive. So we want to pass things that make it beautiful for people. We want a great cost of living. We want beautiful roads, great schools, all those things that we want. So it's an attractive place to come so we can bring business here. The more business we bring here, the more revenue goes up, the more sales tax revenue comes in, the more we have to spend on the infrastructure and police and fire and all the things that make it a great community yeah. to live in. Better for so, everybody. Yeah. Okay, so the question that we all want to know, the yeah. very important question is, what is your favorite flavor of Schubert's ice cream? So my favorite flavor of Schubert's ice cream is so boring. It's chocolate chip. <laughs> we have the grape vanilla that we use, and we hand shave our own chocolate to make chocolate chip ice cream, and I've just been a fan of it for you ever. So I'm kind of a simpleton when it comes to ice cream. I don't go too far out of the box. Well, it's all amazing and great. So um, if you want to help Casey bring our community back to what we know and love. Get out there and vote on November 6th. No matter what your beliefs are politically, make sure you vote if you do want change. So thank you so much, Casey. It was great to be Thanks, here. Thanks, Brandy, for coming down.